Today I'm sharing a simple and delicious recipe for Snickers apple salad. The first thing that you're going to do is place your instant vanilla pudding in a bowl and you're going to add your milk. And whisk until it's fully combined. Next, you're going to gently fold in your whipped topping. Once you have it all combined, you're just gonna set the bowl to the side. Next, I'm gonna work on chopping up my apples. Now, I am using Granny Smith apples because I like the sweet and tart mixture. However, use whatever apple you prefer. One thing I would um, advise you to do is wait until you have your mixture all together, just like I do. Um, you don't wanna cut your apples first and then have them sitting to the side because as you know, apples will turn brown. For some reason with this mixture, apples don't turn brown once you put it in the bowl and mix it with the whipped cream and the pudding. So that's why I like to wait. But you're gonna just cut your slices of apple into bite-sized pieces and then drop them in and then get them covered as quickly as you can. And next, you're just gonna chop up your Snicker bars. I just like to cut mine right down the middle and then I just cut the chocolate into bite-sized pieces. And you just drop them in. Okay, so I've got my Snicker bars all folded in. The last thing you wanna do is just garnish the top with a little bit of those uh, Snicker bar pieces. And one thing I wanted to mention to you is if you don't wanna use vanilla pudding, cream um, cheesecake pudding would be really good. And you could also use some chopped peanuts if you'd like to. I am just going to grizzle, drizzle on a little bit of caramel topping just on top. And this is best eaten within a day or two of making. So that is it. I hope you all enjoyed this recipe. If you did, please make sure to give us a thumbs up. And if you have not subscribed to our channel, I certainly hope you'll do so. Thanks so much for watching and we'll see you all next time.